The health ministry has set new fee benchmarks for private hospitals and doctors. Though this will allow patients to compare costs across health care providers amid rising health care costs. Our data from the ministry shows median private hospital fees rose by an average of 4.5% each year from 2007 to 2021. Sherlin Xiao with this report. Hospitalization due to asthma and appendix removal. These are part of 29 conditions covered under new private hospital fee benchmarks. None of these were covered previously. Surgeon fee benchmarks for 1,900 more procedures are also in place. That's compared to just 200 in 2018, when the benchmarks were first introduced. The guidelines are not mandatory, but the health ministry says healthcare providers can use these recommendations to assess if their charges are reasonable. Patients can also make more informed decisions. For example, when it comes to cataract surgery, the hospital fee should cost no more than $4,700. The surgeon fee shouldn't exceed $4,400 either. The patient will have a better idea of the total bill size. This will help uh, facilitate discussion with the care providers. In the long run, hopefully this will all help to keep healthcare costs sustainable. The health ministry says close to 9 in 10 surgeons have kept their fees within the surgical benchmarks since it was introduced. This has helped to moderate doctor fees at around $1,500. However, total bill sizes continue to exceed $5,000, lifted by increases in hospital fees. It's why the health ministry has pointed out the need for the new benchmarks. In areas like uh, total hospital bill sizes for common conditions and uh, the rest of the surgical fees, it was necessary to start uh, in coming up with new benchmarks because fees in that charges in that area has also been going up. MOH says it will also monitor doctors who continue to charge beyond current benchmarks and consider enforcement if needed. These benchmarks are reviewed every few years.